it's another part of GTA 5 playthrough. Trevor is, Trevor. The Trevor, Trevor is a... Trevor is a what? Uh, Trevor is a good guy. He's like family and got a kid, ain't he, Floyd? So that, 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 that's it, right, yes, Trevor. <laughs> but, but the thing is, um, I ain't been with that many women. I don't find it easy, and, um, and Deborah, I mean, we're getting married, so. Oh, that's beautiful. But I'm scared that she's gonna leave me. I mean, this is her place, and the fornicating? There's Mr. Raspberry Jam. Whoa, whoa! Now, Mr. Raspberry Jam, he died a noble death, bringing great joy to a lonely man. I ain't got a very big penis. Some girls laugh when they, when they look at it. Oh, show no, me. Wait. Okay. Show me! Okay. I, 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 I don't want to. <sighs> Mine ain't nothing so special, but this boy gets the job done. All right? I think I actually saw a bit of that. Oh, Wade here says that you work at the docks. So, yes. Oh, that's true. Look at me! Can you just put your Johnson away? Put your Johnson away. Yes, I work at the oh. docks. And? Anything uh, interesting there for a man oh, like sorry. me? Well, I mean, I, I, I don't rightly, rightly know. What kind of person are you? Oh, I'm that kind of person, Floyd. I am that kind of person. Now, uh, to see let's that. get you, Wade, and that little tormentor down there to put these on. <coughs> we for a ride. Gentlemen, the gateway to America awaits. Run, we got an inside man at the port of LS. I'm gonna send you some information. I need you on point to help plan things. I got it, and I really miss it. Well, I guess we're going to Port City then. Come on, Rich. What you got for me? Like I said, I don't rightly know what we got. You're going to have to be more exact in your questioning, sir. Uh, we're, lo <laughs> we're looking for God. something to steal. Yes, sir. I stole a pencil in elementary school, and I've been regretting it ever since. Boy, I always work a kicking the mud. Look, sir. Please, just tell me what you want, and I'll do my utmost to assist you in finding it. Here's the problem. I don't know what I want. It's a bit, well, like pornography or a perfect term. I, God, can I can't quite can describe it, but I'll know it when I see it. You ain't aiding my comprehension. All right, all right. Well, how's this? 200... And $36 billion worth of cargo came through the port of Los Santos last year. He's real good with numbers. I don't want to hijack a truck full of pineapples, Floyd. Now, a truck full of pineapples, Floyd. You need to give us the inside track on what's coming through. We don't know what's in the containers. They certainly don't put brass tags on them. I haven't noticed anything. Anything different? Anything that might indicate something? Well, there's been all these uh, Meriwether folks hanging around. Meriwether Security Consultant. Private Very army cool. to the New World Order. My That's butt's cool. gone The now. folks waging outsourced shadow wars in 20 countries around the globe and recently cleared to operate on U.S. soil. That, um, sounds, sounds like, like them. So there's a private... Oh, fool, okay. You're a fine fucking fool. Militia oh, in the port. What are they guarding? This one freighter? I guess now that you mention it, it ain't quite right. A freighter. Perfect. Stop. Can I get on board? No, no. They won't let you anywhere near it. They're kind of assholes about it, actually. The other day, my colleague, Ralph... I don't give a shit about Ralph. We gotta it take it a does. look. Is there anything else? Go park and get the dispatch. No, yes, yeah, sir. Well do. Go park and get the dispatch. Here comes the suit. I gotta check in. Remember, Floyd, this can go real wrong real quick. Well, he's particularly drunk. We got a waste spillage and I got a slot on the cleanup crew. There is nothing that Wade here ain't gonna do for a warm meal. Oh, you got 
a strong stomach, son. <laughs> Get in there. You gonna take me to see this freighter? Yeah, it's over here. Okay, we got helicopters coming in and out of here, and all those big sky crane things that can pick up a whole container. Now, this is restricted airspace. They won't let anything out of here without clearance. Wow. Shoot it down if they have to. So how's a man in a hurry supposed to get in and out of this place? Well, we got a port that's stretched to 50 feet. Now, what's the Coast Guard response like? Well, they got cutters, 45-foot response vessels, air support. You're not gonna move much faster than them, especially if you're carrying something. Maybe I'll have to saddle you up and ride you across the Miriam Turner overpass. I just said they have the water surface real covered. Okay. There. Yes, I do He's like the this I told you about. What do you think they got on it? We just stevedore door them. We ain't meant to know what's in the containers. But? But these are marked Based military. Government. Anything weird about that? The government stuff is hot freight. Pulls up, goes right through. This stuff's just been sitting here. You are beginning to arouse my curiosity. Over there, two o'clock. Looks like Forrest got on the wrong side of some Merryweather guys. You! You! We need two guys on the handler. A couple of containers and baby gotta be brought up to F. That ain't a question. Get on it. Now! Get up. We gotta do this. I guess I gotta pretend I'm a dock worker if I want to stay. How about I run that prick over in this thing? I thought you wanted to scope the place. Yeah. We don't get the containers, they're gonna check your card. Oh, I'm getting nervous. You're always nervous, relax. Not always, sir. Just around you. And it's just uh, Cousin Wade's on his own. He better hold it together, stick to the story. It's those containers. Baby, please, just don't. I'm gonna lose my job. They're gonna check us. Oh my god. Slow. Clamp it on now. Shut up. Okay, we got it. Let's take her down to Bay F. I know why they call them handlers, because they handle like a dream. This ain't a toy, sir. It's heavy machinery. Thank <laughs> fuck I'm high as a kite. Yeah. You should not be operating this vehicle while under the influence. I'll operate oh. you under the influence oh. if you're not careful. Huh? Nothing's right that we need two people. Oh, that's good. You happy? Now I'll get the other one for you. Me, anyway. I'm gonna need a better view of that freighter. I'm sorry, but this is as close as you going to get. No, no, no. I need to take some pictures. Send them to my guy, Ron. I'll need a proper view. There's the cranes, but... Cranes! Perfect. Thank you. Oh, shoot. Usefulness for once. I mean, he's actually been quite useful. And helping us get the information that we need. Yeah, this. And attach it! Hey, whose dick you have to suck to get this job? Being a stevedore used to be back-breaking work. Now you're paid brain surgeon bucks to push an oversized shopping cart. I did not fellatiate no one to get this job. I was old friends with the... Well, with the... Well, with the... With the say no more! You didn't fellat no one, but darling Debbie probably yep. did. She probably enjoyed it. Possibly. Still quite a boring I think like yes it's good doing an everyday job sort of thing I quite like it. Given if that my a bit work of here is here. done, I'm going up the gantry. But still it's just it is honestly boring. Oh, well, no, I'll just carry it. You know, I can probably run faster than that thing drives. I may as well just run now. And up we go. And up. Up. Hey! There ain't time to admire the view. I've been waiting on a crowd. 
crane driver nearly an hour. I'm not permitted to drive cranes, buddy. Hey, you need me to get your union rep up here right now? Sooner you get in the cab, sooner we can get out of here. This is on you. <laughs> Come up onto this catwalk, then go down the ladder and into the cabin. Right, I'm here. What do I do? First up, position the cabin over a container. There's some lights on the spreader that should help with alignment. That's it. You're in position. You got it. Now pick it up so it'll clear the other containers and move it down to the end. And take us to the other end. Bay number five. Keep going. Keep this going. This is so much fun. Like, you know, it makes me really want to don't be a clean driver. Like, be a. There's the dots, truck. Set know? it down gentle. Bring the container down over the truck's frame. Truck is clear to go. Signal man and crane driver working together. Now let's do the same thing again. Take okay. us back up to the other end. Never worked so hard in my life. 
It ain't so bad. Uh, I've been doing this every day for ten years. Only, oh, God. only usually with less of the criminality. You're wasting your life, Oi. Floyd. It's lucky we Get turned up when we did. Down. I'm saving you Jesus from Christ. yourself. We ain't heard from Wade. What are you, his mother? He's fine. <laughs> Jack. Oh, God. What was that? Did it hurt? Oh, no. Hey, 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 hey. You can't come through here. It's restricted access. No entiendo. No understand you. Huh? Manifesto. Manifesto say deliver here. Hey, stop. Where the fuck Get do back you think you're going? Get back, back down. Down. finish the day's job anyway, after a hard day of work I, I wish I knew what I was going to say but I don't after a hard day of work we can finally rest up and be criminals again yay I mean technically we were already criminals but we were still oh, being legit hard workers, whereas now we are not doing hard work anymore. So, woohoo! I think. By the way, through here. Yes, I do like that Rockstar put in some like real to keep it a bit realistic. They like, go with a realistic view of the world of doing a hard work King job, but also it is the dullest, most boring mission in GTA 5 in my opinion. This, or I think there's another one, but obviously I can't remember because I haven't played it. But it's either that one or there's another one where it's worse. I'm even thinking of something else, but yeah, that this this is such a horrible mission. 
horrible. Anyway, we're here at Floyd's apartment with the briefcase, so we're all good. Did I ask for that? I asked for you to jump up the stairs. Of course you're not. Oh god. Oh, gee, oh, oh, oh. Oh. What in the name of all things holy? Oh. I, 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 I tried to stop it, but it just kept coming, coming. Oh, it's a, there, there, Wade. Look, 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 it's a, Betty, you're just not cut out for honest work, all right? <laughs> Did you get what you needed? Yeah, 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 more or less. Yeah, I just got to uh, figure out a place to plan this now. All right, this will do. <laughs> that woman I mean, ain't yeah. even fine. Ain't no one understands why Floyd lets her use him so. That's well, uh, low self-esteem, Wade. We got to build him back up. Now. Voila. All right. So, based on my observations, I'd say these Merryweather security cocksnots are sitting on something real valuable. I think they got two of these things, but we only need one. First one is on that freighter in a container below deck. They got guards all over that ship, so it's likely they're keeping it on ice. Uh. The air, land, and sea routes into the port will be locked down as soon as we make a noise at these X's here. Which means we have to blow up the ship and grab the thing underwater. We need a guy to plant the bombs, a guy to look out for him with a rifle, and a guy to grab the thing, whatever it is, underwater. That means stealing us a submarine, of course, but you can find us one of them, can't you? Huh? Nah. Yeah. The other one is off the coast being tested. They're running the operation from the dock where I last saw your cousin. We'll need a submarine for that too, and probably a chopper, a big one. We go out there, look around underwater, locate it, bring it back here, and find out what it is. Here? To sure. Chicago? Aight, so, what do you think? Container ship or whatever's offshore? Well, I am gonna go with the container. It's gotta be the container, right? At least we know about that. You and Floyd can help. We'll get Michael involved and he can put us in touch with some local talent. Yeah, hey, okay, local talent. Okay, alright. What is that smell? Oh, we are going straight to the local union rep. Wade here was injured in the performance of his duties. Human waste has seeped into his very pores. And I am sorry to say this, but I don't think he's ever going to smell normal. <laughs> you can't go to the union. You are union, all right? And you vouched for us, all right? You look at him, man. Smell him. Smell him. Smell him. Trevor, Trevor, uh, you're, you're planning a robbery on my place of work. You violated Mr. Raspberry Jam, and God alone knows what else. You damaged Deborah. Look, my lady and my union, that's all I got. So why don't we just, uh, why don't we just let this all slide? Huh? If you're comfortable with what's happened to your cousin, then so be it, all right? But I would give him a bath and rinse him off. No! No bath! You can't need one. Wait. What, would you rather a shower? A shirt and a shave? TV's broke. Okay, oh god, it's still... All over the place. It's shaky, ain't it? Yeah, toilet now. Ah, Trevor. Hey, Mikey. Hey, listen. Loving it here in LS. Really settling in. Getting my first enema tomorrow. <laughs> anyway, I heard about some action. Yeah. Huh? Yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, yeah. Now, there's still some prep work and research to do, but it's looking exciting. I'll need you to bring along someone you can trust. All right, bro. I know someone. Hey, talk to Lester. He'll have a good angle on this. All right, okay, well, we're going to smudge. Smudge? 
We're gonna smudge over to Michael. We're gonna switch over to Michael. Anyway, where is he? He's thinking, he's still thinking it's the 80s and he's at Plymouth Rock concerts and all that. Nah. Hey! If I were you, I'd worry about a more immediate cause of death. And take a fucking walk. Yeah, get out of here. Right, let's see. I'm gonna go to the FIB and IEA buildings and meet with FIB agents. It's going to be fun. Come on. Oh, fuck. I to the phone. Hey, Trace, what's up? What's up? Are you joking? You ruined my life. I did? I thought I'd already ruined your life. Remember after that boat thing? Take this seriously. Do you know how bad I wanted that? Fame or shame is like an amazing opportunity. You'll get over it. You'll see. I did you a favor. Never! I hate you! Have you too. Jeez. So, there. She's angry. And, well, Jimmy's angry at his old sign. And Amanda's angry at his for filling down a house. Oh! So, I guess no Damn. father of the year award. For us, but I think I think we uh, we we should still be getting one. We should still be getting the Father of the Year award because America, USA, USA, USA. Anyway, here we are at the FIB. Whoa, too close. Building. And this video is already long enough with that last mission. We're gonna make it even longer. If I be here, we are. <laughs> Talking to Dave. Agent Dave, FIB. Oh, the cloud is moving. Nice. You didn't tell me we were double dating. Sorry, guys. This burning hunk of love is all mine. <laughs> Brilliant. Steve Haynes, amigo, but you probably knew that already. Sorry, your name tag must have fallen off. Oh, oh, oh da. I love it. I, I, I gotta remember to write that down. And to shoot you in your head, you annoying dick. <laughs> Andreas, taking notes? This stuff. Whoa. Pure magic. I should put it on my show. Have you seen my show? You mean how to dress like a salesman on a cheap golf weekend at a third-rate country club? <laughs> yeah. So. Uh, well done with our uh, our friend, Mr. K. My pleasure. Uh, I love helping our government wage war, especially with itself. But you made a mistake. Did I, Cupcake? Why don't you keep your fucking voice down before I close your fucking windpipe? The joke stopped now, pal. You will show me and my team some respect. Maybe you could define team for me. Is that just the three of you? Or the greater FIB? Or the entire government? Because I'm tempted to argue that thus far, we haven't shown a lot of your colleagues a whole lot of respect. Why hey. don't you start with me, genius? You got it, pal. So what do you want? We have received intel that they're keeping Mr. K at the local agency station. I just dealt with that guy. The agency is stepping up to questioning because of your moronic antics down at the coroner's office. We need to get him out of there before he blabs. I did what Agent Norton said. Then I guess you getting involved with a clapped out old agent who's been living off of past glories was your first mistake. You are my boy now, amigo. My career depends on this. And that's very important to me. So seeing as we're all boys now, that makes it important to you. Okay. You'll run along, kids. Sure thing. See the
See, there you go, Dave. You can't teach an old dog new tricks. Come on. The Bureau owns a lot out in East L.S. Covington supplies off El Rancho. Can you take us there? Yeah, sure. Sounds nice and secluded. Kind of place you'd run an off-the-books operation, huh? So what? So I bet Federal ain't on the deed. That's so. And we all like our Federal government open and transparent. Except when closed and opaque suits you better. Hey, I'm just a puppet. You're the one pulling the strings. Yeah. Fixing up my car. Call him, or we'll send some G men to his aunt's house. Okay. Hey. Okay. This way? Mike, this ain't the best time. I'm kind of busy. Hey, sorry about that. Listen, you know that thing we talked about before? It's happening. I need you to come to a lot off El Rancho, not far from where we met before. All right, that's cool. I'm in LS anyway. Okay, that's now, good, that's good. Trevor Phillips. So, uh, oh, you're crazy. What? I ain't calling him. I thought you might say that. So we had him picked up. That's a dumb move, Dave. Real fucking dumb. Just worry about the plan, okay? Why, Getting Trevor? Mr. K out of the IAA station. Clinton is going to be positioned across the street, keeping an eye on the proceedings. Phillips flies you in. And rappel down, make the extraction. And I'm the best guy you got for this. With you, we've got good leverage. Great. And you brought Trevor in. We're telling him I'm all closed with the FIP. You'll need discreet support. We'll maintain control of the situation. You know what? You better keep a low profile. Yeah, I think I will. See you later. Who's that cagey motherfucker, huh? No, it's another cagey motherfucker, all right? Not you. Hey, T, enough with the faux political bullshit. Yeah, come then, Trevor. Franklin, come on, you better take off. Really? Shit, I'm good. I ain't Bill. Whoa. Well, am I detecting some, uh, some sort of, uh, son I never had bullshit here, Mikey, huh? Hey, listen, if you want to replace some father figure, you can do a lot better than this fat snake, all right? This fucker would eat his own kids. Like I said, Franklin, deranged. Yeah, and best friend. <laughs> exactly. That's Trevor, my best friend. That's Franklin, the son I always wanted. All right, guys, listen, this is the shot. I'm gonna do all the heavy lifting on this job, okay? Trevor, all I need you to do is fly me to the target. Franklin, you're gonna cover me from across the street. We're gonna make these assholes happy, and we're gonna walk away from this thing clean. Got it? I got you. All right? And we do this, and they help us bring Brad, right? Yeah. We'll talk about Brad later, all right? I gotta change. You better grab a head start. Nice to meet you, homie. Yeah, whatever. Yay! The government gimp at last. Eh, ah, bite me. Let's go! What? Alright, let's do this thing. Nice go, come on. We need to go to the agency headquarters downtown. Your new friends are a riot! No wonder you said sayonara to the old crew. Walking away ain't easy, Trev. And sometimes I guess you gotta make compromises. What happened to dying with a gun in your hand? Life happened. Annoying wife, two kids. Remember them? You get tied down, you can't move anymore. What about your ties to me? To Brad? Those ties are why you got roped in on this FIB instigated suicide pact. For yep. as long as it keeps me amused, I am. I ain't exactly sure it's gonna be amusing. We'll see. You know, you had me at suicide pack. <laughs> Yay, you're welcome. Okay, here we are. If I be building. I'm going in on the west side of the tower. Get us in position. I'll drop. And you have the IE for me. You fuck around right. while I'm out there. I'll climb back up this rope and strangle you with it. Yeah. Whee! Woo! Hey. Keep her steady! Keep her steady! Next I'll have this thing so far up your ass 
your tonsils will be playing shadow puppets. You think we can't do that? We can. My it's in our not hear me. I don't know what you're talking about. I install cinema. I can hear it. Not surveillance. I can see a rope. Grab his other arm. No, Look no, up. no, 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 no. There's oh, Michael. Oh, 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 oh. You think you're impenetrable? Just like Michelle. See how you feel with this is 18 inches deep inside. Get the lube. Who the fuck is this? Terminate him. Close this problem right now. Yeah, I can use a little backup here. Get me this thing. 36 flow. I got you.
go through. Another mission we've got through and another of the bad guys we've killed. Well, we say bad guys. Just guys, you get me. Yeah, 7 out of 10 hits off, not bad, 17% accuracy. Ooh, not very good. And 12 minutes on that mission. Well, that's this episode done. Two missions done. Working with FIB, included all three characters in one mission for the first time. Well, until the next episode, I'll see you guys later.